at Disney Pixar's world premiere of Incredibles 2. Craig T. Nelson and Holly Hunter reprise their roles. Let's take a first look. Behold the Underminer! Watch after Jack Jack. But I thought we were gonna go You with heard your mother trampolining. We meet again. Superheroes are illegal. We want to fight bad guys. I use the bad guys. It defines who I am. We're not saying you have... What? Someone on TV said it. What did you love about playing Elastigirl this time around? Well, I, I just think that she was unapologetic about her powers, unapologetic about her about her gift that she wanted to, to give to the world, um, which I think is kind of a great message that the movie talks about but doesn't like you know, slam in your face, which is to live up to the gift that you have. Well, it's so cool that, that this is happening, you know, it's kind of dovetailing with the Me Too and mm -hmm. Time's Up movements, um, which, you know, is just kind of beautiful timing. But I think people will revel in her, in her um, power as a woman. Yeah, Lucius is back. I'm bringing Lucius back. Okay. <laughs> you know, um, Interestingly time consuming, but we do it. You know, every time they call, I go, okay, wow, they come to the studio. Yes. So, anybody else gonna be there? No. Okay, fine. Just Brad, me and Brad. Okay, that's good. So, it's, it's, it's an amazing challenge to be in a room with just one person, uh, not knowing what's actually gonna be on screen, and him describing it to me verbally and saying, okay, now say it. So, that makes us pretty accomplished. We're getting things done. How much fun is it being able to step into this voiceover role? I mean, I would say as a person in real life, I am more an alter ego, you know? Okay. I, um, yeah, I do sit in a room writing books by myself and Violet goes out and, you know, fights bad guys and whatnot. So, um, I, I think um, the one thing she and I have in common is we both have a bit of a sharp tongue, you know? We don't, we, we don't always say the polite thing. We're a little bit of a wise guy, both of us. I've got to succeed so she can succeed. So we can succeed. I get it, Bob. What the? That is freaky. But I can't keep giving him cookies. Oh! Nobody in the day. I'm really excited. I, I'm just going to have fun like everybody else, I hope. I, you know, the thing I feed off of are my grandkids and uh, how much they're into it. Now I've got great grandkids, so it's going to be like great, you know, fantastic to see them and see the reactions and and all of that. So I'm, you know, that's fun. What kind of inspiration did you take playing this character in the second film? I loved the first movie and I just loved Dash and I think that superhero movies are my favorite movies. They're like my favorite types of movies and Incredibles was one of my favorite and yeah and I just, that's where I got my inspiration. Well what was your favorite part about playing Dash? Um, my favorite part was just being able to meet everyone, being able to run around studio, being able to be so enthusiastic and energetic. That's not the way you're supposed to do it, Dad. They want us to do it this I don't way. know that way. Why would they change math? Uh, math is math. Okay, math Dad. is math. All over Dusseldorf. Dussels are dozing. Their eyelids so heavy, they're drooping. Mm. Closing! What was the most important thing for you guys to co convey in the storyline this time around? Uh, I think it's, it's going to sound incredibly shallow, but fun, you know. Uh, it's, it has stuff in it that people will uh, be able to talk about afterwards, but really the, the goal is just to have a rockin' good time at the movies. And uh, uh, I think we picked that up right at the beginning with uh, right where the last film left off, and it doesn't let up. It goes and goes and goes, and it needs to be consumed with oil drum-sized popcorn. And uh, another oil drum size cola that you all can have multiple straws in, and it's 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 just very intense. Uh, I don't feel like I'm uh, acting Edna. She kind of has her own way of being, so she's not very cooperative. She doesn't show up a lot of times. She, she doesn't show up. She says you will wait. She's not, she's you know? not here. We can't find her. She's she's, yeah, she's busy. Yeah. She's too. very temperamental. You know, she says she has other things to do. She's not an actress. Stop bothering her, darling. Yeah, it's yeah. all that kind of stuff.
Done properly, parenting is a heroic act. <laughs> Done properly. <laughs> I cannot wait to see this movie. You guys, thank you so much for watching. Make sure to comment below and give me a like, and don't forget to subscribe. My name is Kira Lynn. Peace out, guys.